Hello everyone, this is Angela again and I'm doing another plan with me and this week is for the 2nd to the 8th of July and this week I'm going to be using a kit from Jackson Paper I really loved their photo kits and it's always in a pastel color um, scheme that I really love so that's why I bought quite a bit of their kits um, right now, I'm going to be putting down my um, bottom washi because I. That's always the first thing I do during a weekly kit. But the best thing is, this bottom washi is like a scene, it's not like a repeating pattern, and this is just a little bit new and exciting for me. It's more interesting than normal, um, to be sure. So. Uh, I started with the date covers. I wrote down all the dates on the boxes. Well, not boxes, the little circles on the date covers and then start putting them down onto the dates. I love the date covers because it's... Well, I kind of love photo kits because it's not like a normal kit where the clip art or the digital papers are the background. It's actually scenes that you kind of see in everyday life and it's just a lot more real than you know just nicely drawn kits um, I know that because I make kits myself and I know how um, they come to be and how it's made and then I realized that people who make photo kits are just like really talented because I realize it's quite difficult to do and I haven't that aptitude for it so it's just um, amazes me that they can do it so nicely so I put down that book um, full box at the thankful thoughts um, right at the top there before I placed a washi down and a hydration box down so usually every week I would have tracked hydration workouts and um, what's the last thing? Skincare? Oh no, sleeping times, yeah. So I usually track workout sleeping times and hydrations and that's what I'm doing for this week as well. And then I placed a really cute every minute a story beanie um, that represents working out. And obviously I placed it at the wrong place because um, that's the box for my sleeping time um, tracking but I placed the workout over there I should have placed it down at the habit tracker there but whatever it's still nice anyway and I know what I'm tracking so it's fine um, so when I'm starting on Monday I put down a label with a fridge from the every minute a story cheat sheet and I know it's supposed to be a cheat day fridge, but since it's a fridge, I am okay with it representing my breakfast. And I wrote down sandwich and milk. My mom bought this really cool Hokkaido milk, 10 packets of them. And they are so cute. It's just a 200 ml package and I mean packets. And it's so cute and I really love it. I love this brand. I drink cartons of them really quickly but those packets packets are just so cute and and they had a promotion where if you buy five packets of them you get a cooler bag so yeah my mom kind of bought quite a lot but i like them so i'm pretty sure i would drink them all up pretty soon um below that i wrote workout um dot dot domination is what cassie likes to call workouts for apps and I'm kind of just um, imitating her and I really really hate my handwriting right there um, it kind of clashed with the line and I wrote smaller and smaller and I don't like this style of handwriting it just looks really um, unruly and just untidy yeah but I placed a workout beanie right beside it and then put a half box below writing design for more collections with a um, bunny in front of a laptop from Pretty and Prim Coke. Then I added a full box, which is 
also really cute and then i placed another label with a cup and wrote soup with bread then after that i placed a to-do header and wrote down all my tuition timings and schedule with a cut up um, scalloped heart checklist and lastly i wrote smoothie at the bottom because i decided to um, drink smoothie for dinner and since i'm gonna be working until um, after nine i decided well smoothie can be brought around and i can just um um, bring it around with me and drink it when I'm hungry so it doesn't really matter if, we are, if I'm out late yeah so that's the thought when I decided to get smoothie or to make smoothie and now I'm going to be doing my Tuesday and for this week my breakfast is still as unoriginal as ever I'm going to get toast and of course, the really cute Happy Daya cup there is just so cute. I love Happy Daya stickers. And then I placed the label below and um, labeled another edit video script words on top that comes from Virgo and paper. And then I used another Happy Daya recording camera to write record voice over. And I know you guys know this record voiceover means this voiceover that I'm recording right now But today is actually Thursday, I'm two days late And just to let you guys know I'm late for everything Like, okay, the design for more collections is late My um, soup with bread is late I haven't even touched the soup that I wanted to make and the bread is still sitting on my table well the smoothie isn't late I actually made the smoothie and I did drink it on Monday so yeah um, I actually didn't really follow this plan that much but I've been trying but I've been kind of busy and weirded out with the new schedule I realized that by taking in a lot more students than I'm used to has messed up with my routine and it takes a bit of time to adjust um, but I went right ahead to write workout on a header and placed another workout beanie on top then I proceeded to write lunch with the word fish right beside it I wanted to eat fish for lunch which I did not but yeah because on the previous night my dad bought um, fried rice for dinner and there were some leftovers so I kind of ate the leftovers for lunch because I didn't want to waste it so now the fish is kind of neglected and is not yet eaten so yeah um, but I placed a flag road post package beside it with a little cute little mailbox beanie right beside it and again i'm late i didn't do it at all i was so busy i didn't have time to go to the post office so i kind of um gave it to my dad and told him oh, i'll just do it during your lunch if you can um that was kind of bad of me but <laughs> it got the thing done so whatever um i placed another um, label below and then i wrote design right on top of a really cute happy dia laptop sticker i love this sticker as i said in my haul it just um gives me the space to write even though it's a clip up on its own so i love it um i wrote down my um tutoring schedule below a to-do uh, or today header um, in a cut up full box checklist and then wrote dinner with family at the bottom together with a box sampler from um what's that shop again little miss papery it's a sampler i believe so it's really cute i love the bow and it's foiled so it's really pretty and then I wrote cut nails at the bottom, which I am late again. My nails is still long as ever, and I cannot stand it another day. But 
I have not cut it yet. <laughs> I used the other half of the checkbox and wrote breakfast and workout and placed it under the to do header on Wednesday. Then I used a pretty and cream called sticky notes sticker and placed a tea bag beside it and wrote cook lunch. And right below it, I labeled um, well, not labeled, I layered a change bed sheet um, happy dia sticker onto a half box, which is really pretty by the way. And then I wrote cooked dinner and then pack it beside a very cute exclamation mark sticker from Stick With Me Shop on um, the sticky rings um, bundle. Yeah, and I am glad to share that I actually did change my bed sheets and also cook dinner and pack it. So on Wednesday, everything kind of went smoothly up to the afternoon. I labeled, well, I didn't label, I placed a label down and put down a happy dial print and card sticker, but I did not print and cut. So yeah. I also wanted to vacuum on Wednesday and I especially wanted to vacuum my room. There's a lot of hair lying around. Well, for girls, every day is a fight to not lose any hair. But I did not do that as well. But I wrote down a to-do uh, list below together with my um, tutoring schedule. And I have to say, this is the most failure day of the week because... I did not go to any of these lessons at all. I decided to stay home. I texted the parents and said I had an, a thing at home and that I'm going to be missing one lesson because I have to catch up to the things that I didn't do on Monday and Tuesday. And I did, I really did, but I didn't catch up up to Wednesday. So everything is just pushed back and <laughs> not really working out at all. Um, and at the end there, I wanted to design another four collections and obviously that has not happened um, but the beanie stickers at the side of it is still really cute uh, at the start of Thursday, I wrote lifestyle blog breakfast and workout on a half check box check half checklist box uh, yeah, and um, today is Thursday, so we'll see if I can finish all these tasks. I put a solid washi down and then um, layered a Happy Daya print sticker, which is really cute with the panda on top. And I wanted to like finally print the stuff. And I just did like this morning. This is afternoon in Singapore, and I did it this morning, so I did print. Well, no, I, now all I have to do is to cut it. So, yeah, but at least there's some progress, right? And then I um, wanted to indicate I'm going to eat lunch after printing. So I put down another solid washi and then I wrote lunch with a little cute heart right beside it and placed down a happy daya cute little cup beside it. I then placed the full box right below it and another to-do header. Followed by a checklist and again my tutoring schedule for the day. Um, but one of the parents just texted me and said they are going to be having dinner um, tonight. So I am not going to that um, student's house today. So one of the lessons is cancelled. Then I placed a half box below it and wrote cook and pack dinner. But something unexpected happened today. My mom has... Uh, think, um, and I think he's going. She's going to cook dinner tonight, and she's going to cook early. I think, so that I can pack it to bring out with me when I go out. On Friday, I placed the full box first because I know that uh, most of the full box are in the middle of the spread, and I didn't want them to repeat again like the previous week. So I quickly put down the full box first then I put a half box down together with a, a Etsy mail sticker mail um, sticker from Happy Daya right on top and 
that is going to remind me to collect my mail and I did is already here and I already collected it so this is the one of the few things that I did early and then I wrote down blog onto a pretty and prim co banner and wrote beside it finished journal and I'm supposed to be doing a draft and schedule a post right below it I put down a pattern washi well it's not a pattern washi but a scenic washi I think and then I have labeled layered a print and cut sticker on top and hopefully I can finish this I put down a today header and then wrote down my schedule for the day and at the bottom I wrote dinner with my sister I call her Jiajie in Chinese so yeah I I uh, put down a what's that called every minute a story beanie family or bff kind of um, dinner scene happening and wrote dinner with the terry at the bottom um, first thing i have to do during the weekend is of course the weekend banner so i placed that down and was kind of disappointed that it ran short so if you look at the end there you can still see the dotted lines because i did it wrong but i didn't want to peel it up again because it's going to destroy the paper so i didn't um, I placed a hard box, well not hard box, a half box um, below it and layered a pretty and print called teaching sticker and wrote the time that I need to go to this student's house. Right after that, I used a solid washi and wrote nap on it because I know after this, I'm definitely going to be napping because I am going to sleep at like 3am and wake up at, I don't know, 6am so after everything is done and i get home i'm definitely going to be sleeping the really cute pretty and prim curl sleeping pillow sticker is just so cute and i have wanted to use it since i got it so i did um right below it i wrote to collect mail because there's another set of mail coming and the really cute happy daya um well is that a bear a bear postman um kind of sticker is just really cute not to use and then i placed half the checklist and wrote film haul edit haul and schedule upload but considering my mail could be late i might not be able to film the haul on saturday so hopefully i did get everything but if not then my haul will be filmed on well maybe tuesday or wednesday next week and well then my haul video is going to be kind of late and then i labeled um design on and then place the label like to cover the two lines between the two boxes and then put down a really cute coffee icon from the kit and then i use stick with me stickers that says pack orders and that's exactly what i wanted to do and then i write pre-plan and meal plan onto a solid washi and then use one of the plan time icons from the kit and below i used a really cute half um circle semi-circle kind of circle thing um below and wrote drop box because um my drop box subscription fees are due and i didn't want to forget on sunday i wrote film plan with me and spc subscription because that's one i have to pay for my scribble print school subscription but i used um this really cute youtube sticker and then i used the day off um arrow from the kit and wrote church so Sunday is a day off and on Sundays I always go to church so I use both of those stickers <laughs> then I wrote grocery shopping onto a label and layered a really cute shopping cart on top then I used the Virgo and paper sticker that says let your light shine because I have no idea what I'm going to be doing on Sunday so I used that to fill up some space and then I used the last part of the checklist that i cut up just now and i wrote workout and then i placed another working out beanie on top followed by a full box at the bottom 
but then I I forgot I needed to write design, so I used another Happy Dia Wacom tablet sticker. So that's it. This is my week. Hope you guys like my、um, plan with me. Um, please subscribe if you want to see more plan with me, and I promise you'll see more of this type of videos. Thank you.